Hello everyone, this is Haran Ambos Pistoros, Senior Technical Analyst here at IronFX Global, bringing you the technical updates for June 15th. Today let's see the technical pictures of uh, Euro Sterling and Euro Yen, which both uh, gapped down on Monday after Greece's talks with uh, its lenders during the weekend ended with no agreement. So let's start our treatment with uh, Euro Sterling. Euro Sterling opened the day with a gap down but the decline stayed limited near the 0.72 support barrier. Last Thursday, the pair fell below the support uh, turned into resistance uh, line of 0.7265 and uh, completed a double top formation on the 4-hour chart. This has shifted the short-term outlook to the downside in my view and therefore I would expect a decisive move uh, below 0.72 to pave the way for our next support area of uh, 0.7145. Our short-term oscillators uh, detect downside speed and support the aforementioned scenario. The RSI already below its 50 line has turned down again while uh, the MAC distance below both its zero and trigger lines and points uh, south. On the daily chart, the pair has been trading in a tr in a non-trending mode since uh, mid-March. Uh, Therefore, although we may see some further declines in the short run, I would consider the overall outlook uh, to be neutral. Now let's carry on with uh, Euro Yen. This pair also gapped down on Monday after it hit resistance at 139.30. However, the rate found support at uh, 138 and rebounded somewhat. A clear and decisive move below 138 is now needed to confirm a forthcoming lower low on the 4-hour chart and make me more confident on, on the downside. Something like that could uh, pave the way for the next support at 137. Our short-term oscillators detect negative momentum and corroborate that view. The RSI hit resistance at its 50 line and slid lower while the MAC distance below both its zero and trigger lines. On the daily chart, the break above 131.40 on the 29th of April signaled a medium term uh, trend reversal in my view. As a result, I would consider the medium-term trend of uh, Euro-Yen to be positive. I would treat any near-term declines as a corrective phase of that uptrend. So that's it for today. For more analysis and charts, please read the full comment on ironfx.com. You can also follow us on Twitter like us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, or circle us on Google Plus to get more trading ideas. This is Harald Ambos Pissuros, Senior Technical Analyst at IronFX Global, wishing you solid trading.